Hello and welcome. My name is Jay. I recently posted a video where I built a gaming PC with two GTX 1070 graphics cards. This video is a follow up of that. This is a desk setup and tour video. What I was hoping to create was a simple and functional setup that also looks good without having to spend too much. Most of the products that you see here in this video were purchased online and I have provided the links below in the description. Let us begin with the smaller stuff on the side. First is a blue snowball microphone that I currently use to record voiceovers such as this. Next is a Samsung Galaxy Tab S2 9.7 inch tablet. Next to the tablet is the DJI Osmo Mobile. I have been using this on and off and I have to say I am very impressed. Just attach your phone, walk, run, jump with it and you will still end up with stable videos. There is a tracking feature in this that I especially like. Let me know in the comments below if you want to see some sample videos. Down here are some peripherals that I frequently use. First is this Steel CD Stratus XL controller. As you can see it's kind of bulky. I still actually prefer the old PS3 DualShock controller when gaming. These are just a couple of magazines. And this is the Logitech 480 keyboard. Typing with it is actually not that great but it has one killer feature that I like. It has multi-device capability, so switching between the tablet, the laptop or the desktop is very easy. Up here is the Alienware 13 second generation laptop. It has an i7-6500U processor, 16 gigs of RAM and a GTX 960M graphics card. It's uh, super fast for daily tasks but not so much for gaming. Being a gaming laptop, it can handle the older games very well but not the new ones. I get about 30 to 35 frames per second on medium to high settings normally. These are the two displays that I have connected to my desktop. The first one is a 24 inch LG IPS LED display. I actually like this display for two reasons. One, the bezels on it are very thin. And two, the viewing angles are great. This is a 60Hz display and I know that it's not great for gaming but until I get a better one this is what I have. The next one is something I had from the past. It is a Dell 20 inch regular LCD display. Behind the laptop and these displays I have a Philips Hue lamp and the light strip running across the desk. The speakers that you see here are just temporary. Although they have some sort of liquid inside them and a few lights, they put on a show when the music is loud enough. Up next are the input devices. I have a Logitech G602 gaming mouse and a Logitech G310 gaming keyboard. The mouse pad with RGB lighting that you see here is the Razer Firefly pad. It has a configurable RGB lighting and effects making it look really cool in the dark. Now for the big one. This is the heart and brain of the setup. I call this desktop the Razer. It has an i7-6700K processor, a MSI M7 gaming motherboard, 16 gigs of RAM and a GTX 1070 8GB graphics card from EVGA. I am yet to post the benchmark video for it, but I can tell you that it can handle anything you throw at it. I get a steady 60 frames per second at 1080p with ultra setting in most of the games. This is a storage unit of many things. In these top shelves, I store boxes of products that I have purchased over time. 
In these boxes are warranty cards, cables, manuals, etc. You never know when they might come handy. On the right shelf, I have a few product brochures, an old PS3 that still works perfectly, a few books that I've read, a few PS3 games and a few Blu-ray movies. In these bottom shelves are a few old gadgets and peripherals. I have a few extra keyboards, this Raspberry Pi, the Samsung Gear VR headset and a Nerf gun. As you can clearly see, I don't have a fancy YouTube production rig yet, but I will certainly keep adding more stuff to try and bring you better looking videos. Thank you for watching and please subscribe.